So, what do you think about the war? I think it's pointless. Why kill each other? Well, they're trying to fight off people like Hitler so others don't have to suffer. But war is nothing but suffering. That's true. But it won't reach us here in the U.S. Well, I certainly hope not. You know how my dad's been sick lately? Yeah, how's he been, by the way? Have you heard from him recently? I have, actually. My mom thinks he's gonna die soon. Oh, I'm really sorry to hear that. Is, is there anything I can do for you? Well, I have to go to Pearl Harbor to visit them. I'll be gone for her about a month. Are you gonna be okay without me? Of course. Are you sure you'll be fine by yourself? You don't need me to come with you? Don't worry, I'll be fine. Okay, just be careful. Yesterday, December 7, 1941, a date which will live in infamy, the United States of America was suddenly and deliberately attacked by naval and air forces of the Empire of Japan. Listen. As Commander-in-Chief of the Army and Navy, I have directed that all measures be taken for our yes, defense. In Pearl Harbor? Wait, what? what? Uh, dude, my brother's in Pearl Harbor. Nicole's there. And her parents, too. Dude, I hope they're okay. I doubt they bomb a civilian area. What if they bomb a civilian area next time? What about my brother? What about my Nicole? Then we'll stop them from doing that. We'll enlist. What if we don't come back? Darren, what if your brother died? And you didn't do anything about it? He'd have died for nothing. The Japanese would just continue their attacks. And we have to come back. It seems like you make up your mind. If I had a penny for every time you made that face, I'd drown in my own money. Well, so you need someone to protect you. So I'm coming. Alrighty then. We leave tomorrow. Alright! Are you guys ready to murder some Nazis? This war is to protect our home, America. We're not killers, but we will not hesitate when we're under attack. Understood? Yes, yes sir. sir! Major General Wainwright will be here to observe your training. Don't piss him off. Run 20 and get ready for your next exercise. Yes, yes sir! backed out if I didn't come with you. Yeah? Keep telling yourself that. Congrats, rookies. You guys are ready for battle. Training is nothing compared to the battlefield. All hell breaks loose. General Wainwright will take him clear. As commander of the Philippine Division, I wanted to choose the best men to serve under my command. Nafi, Jaren, Sean, Andrew, 
amongst all the trainee squads you form a proven most capable. Don't let me down. Go home, say your goodbyes. We'll call you up when we're ready. Dismissed! Because you could have gotten hurt. But I didn't. I'm fine. But yeah, but I couldn't live with myself if you got hurt and I didn't do anything about it. You didn't even talk to me about this. Yeah, I know. What but... were you thinking? Well, when Pearl Harbor got bombed, I, I couldn't just sit back and do nothing when, when you could have been injured. What happens when you don't come home? I will. I promise you. We went through training and everything. Just make sure you come home. So what was your grade in Sanchez before you enlisted? Dude, yeah, it was like that. I can't even remember. I couldn't race it. I think it was uh... Oh dear! You four, check it out! More. You two gave me enforcement. Blue, cover fire. Right in the hole. Not me. You're gonna be all right. Get me right. Reinforcement, north sector. You're gonna be all right. Shot, get out of here. Nothing. Bad. We need to get back to base. Exactly. Reloading. Woo! No, man. You're gonna be all right. Man, you're gonna be all right. If I had a penny for every time you made that face. No, don't worry, man. I got you. Tell Nicole. I'm sorry. No, no, man. Don't say that. Don't say that. You're gonna make it back. You promised.
It's gone now. Let it go already. Oh, he'll make it. Pick him up. That's an order. This is Major General Wainwright. All squads retreat. There is a limit to human endurance. And that limit has long been passed. Jaren, you're back. Are you guys all right? Where's Andrew? Nicole, we've been fighting in the Philippines for a few months now. They've been pushing us back even though we outnumber them 3 to 2. But we're not going down without a fight. I'm sorry I didn't talk to you about enlistment, but I'll make it up to you when I come back, and you won't be disappointed. I enlisted to keep you out of harm's way, and that gives me the strength to keep fighting. So, wait for me.